Hi guys, uh, this is 2009 uh, Toyota Prius uh, 20 series model. So this car had a problem is uh, when driving in the freeway, it's a car is suddenly stopped. So no any light in the dash, nothing, just only working in the the 12 volt battery only. So this uh, no power. When we put in the key inside. It's nothing. We press the brake. There's no power button is it light on and there no any light on the dash. Nothing. So when we go to the fuse box, when you open that the fuse box in here. Okay. We have to check this uh, the AM2 fuse, the 15 amp. Is this one? This fuse is keep blowing. That's why it's, uh, the car is stopped. So when you check the fuse, the 15 amp, it's no power that side. This all feels good, but this uh, AM2 15 and fuse is keep blowing. Okay, let me take it out that fuse. It's blown. This area you can smell the like a, it's a burning smell. This uh. This inverter and the cooling pump, this one is a short circuit. So that's why it's a key blowing uh, this uh, 15 amp fuse. So this pump is, pump is uh, in internally short failure. So it's not pumping the coolant for the inverter. The inverter getting hot. So that's why it's a blowing this fuse. So we need to replace this uh, the inverter cooling pump. So uh, then uh, we can fix the problem. So uh, it's very smelly in here, like an electrical burning. Okay, guys, here's the the pump. You can take it out. So this pump. Uh, inside inside is a failure inside the short circuit so that's why it keeps blowing that uh, AM2 fuse so we need to replace this part you can see so we need to off this cover first there are a lot of so plastic clips in there to the access this uh, the pump so we need to off this bracket So you can see the pump now clearly the uh, three ten mil bolts and we have to off this the uh, the coolant hose so you can see the clearly three ten mil bolt one two three you can see the coolant also leak I can smell feel the the burning smell Okay, off the V3 bolt. And off that the two holes in the bottom and top. Okay.
Okay, then another the bottom hose in here. Okay, guys, we have the the pump. Can take it out. Okay, this is the short pump. It's very like I feel in a burning smell. Okay, guys, uh, here's the old one. This is the new one. I'm going to test the two uh, pump. This one is a two, 12 volt. So we need to put here. It's getting keep shorting. You can see. So this one, it's a new one. It's working. This pump is working. All good, so we replace for this one. Guys, we tied all the three bolts. Keep on, we put back the plug back in. Yes, all good. Now after that, put the the top hose. All good. Click back in. Right. Good. Okay, guys, you're going to install the new fuse. Okay, then after we check the fuse again. All good. Fuse is not uh, keep blowing. The both side is power okay. So let's go to the inside car then have a look at the dash where these lights coming on. Okay guys, we put the key in. Yeah, it's a power is there now. Remember, the starts with myself. So there's his light is on. But triangle mask is there. We have to erase that uh, triangle mark. Along the way, one bag vanishes. Not so wonderful. Okay. Car is running, thread is fine. Okay guys, this is how the fix the keep blowing fuse where M2 fuse. So this is the end of the video. Thanks for watching my videos. We'll see you in the next one.